Oh, yeah, y'all, back up in Shenandoah, and look who's back with me. It's the blue bear. Here I am. Poor blue bear is still recovering from her meniscus tear, but we're coming <laughs> along uh, bit by bit, to be sure. And we are getting ready to complete the hike that we started last year, and that is Dickey Ridge Hike. Yes, indeed. And so, my friends, we are right here in this parking lot. Maybe what parking lot is? Compton... Compton Gap, Compton Gap mm -hmm. Trailhead Parking Lot. Yes, indeed. Up to Dickey Ridge Trail. Yes, of course, that's the northern district of Shenandoah National Park, a park we've been hiking now for nine years. Mm. So sit back, strap in, and let OMC set, set you free. free. We just started out. As you can see, it's a nice trail. Got us a crossroads here. So there's the Appalachian Trail over on this side, which Barb and I did the whole thing. Not the whole, whole thing, but the whole thing up here. And then the signs instructing us as to where we should go next. Dickey Ridge is to the right, guys, the right. So that means just up here. And so we're gonna go and check that out and let you guys know what we see. I'll tell you friends, this is a pretty, pretty trail. We got a lot of things blooming right now. As you can see, springtime is definitely here and it always comes a month later to the mountains than to our lowlands. Just a nice, good old green tunnel situation right here with some sick rocks to boot. Cool guys, look at this, there's a little path that leads up here to these rocks. There might be some unusual geological formations to check out. Barbara, you wanna see these formations? Yeah. Who's ah? Let's go check it out. Look at this guys. We're up here on the top, a kind of little canyon, a canyon junior. Up here, what else do we got? Ooh. Some more very, very pretty flowers. And that's about it. Nice, oh, here we go. Here we go, we got the Secret Shire. This is where the little omelets come to have meetings. Look at that, oh, and a nice little view, dog. Who's that, so that's a cool discovery. So we have yet another one of these 
micro canyons right here. Very cool. And a sweet little taste of view on the tippy top. Hello everyone. So my name is Blue Bear and that is short for blueberry and also a blue bear. So I love berries. I love them so much. I love picking them, eating them, just everything about them. I love it how they stain my fingers. Um, anyway, so if you look over here, all these white flowers are going to be raspberries. So they're showing off their blooms and they're attracting all the pollinators and the pollinators are gonna come and they're going to turn these into real live raspberries. Now, if you are up this side of the woods, like Dickey's Ridge Trail or Compton Gap, I've noticed that they're covered in berries of all kinds. And so if just kind of keep an eye on the season, when the season is going to come in. And then if you came up here with gallon buckets, I guarantee you, you're going to leave with a gallon of berries. So it's beginning. Hey friends, we are out here at a crossroads. So you will cross the road a couple of times. And then why were you having a little trouble with your downhills? With the downhills, yeah. Because the meniscus? Yeah. Yeah. So because when you have a torn meniscus, one of the um, problems you have is with downhill because the meniscus is a, a kind of pad, like a shock absorber. And if it's damaged, you know, the body takes the shock instead of the pad. So we're um, having some, some challenges with that, but we're powering through. Or I shouldn't say we, Barb is. I'm, I'm okay. Sorry, Barb. No, you're good. But yeah, we're, we're getting through it, guys. So don't worry. We got more to go. Dickey's Ridge is going up now. And so we are about to continue to climb and travail this great and manly obstacle. Alright friends, we're coming downhill right now. And I can tell you that the climate up here is absolutely perfect today. Oh my God. It's like 70 degrees, barely, maybe 68. It feels so good. And you can see this trail is very well kept and very laid back. So if you want just a nice kind of break-in experience here at Shenandoah, just a good walk in the woods, this Dickey's Ridge is fantastic. The first part of it is a lot more challenging where you have to ascend um, quite a lot. I think it's about a 1500 1600 foot ascent very steep very uh very abrupt but this is nothing like that at all so you just have beautiful tulip poplar trees all around very very mellow my friends and what's wrong with that huh you know once in a while you got to just kick back and enjoy this beautiful beautiful nature that surrounds us all All right, friends, we're coming up on the next trail post here, and there is some kind of letter, a secret message that's been left to all of us. What does it say, Barbie? Non-native invasive plant control area. Spraying stuff on it. Uh, oh, we saw that. We saw the little green plants. That, yeah. That was the weird green. So that's what they're doing. They're going up and along the trail and they're spraying oh, okay, guys. non-natives. All right, so don't chew the plants if you're out here on Dickey's Ridge. <laughs> hey, friends. I'm on the top of Dickey Ridge Hill. Check it out. Yeah, it's some kind of a cell phone tower. So it's a good thing I don't have any fillings or I'd be listening to FM radio right now. In any case, friends, Barbie got a little sore with that meniscus, and so she stayed down the trail a bit. I left her with the bear spray so she's safe and sound, and I'm going to head back down, walk her to the nearest um, drive through intersection. We're going to get her back on the Skyline Drive. I'm going to leave her somewhere comfortable with the spray, and then I'm going to walk the remainder on the Skyline so I can get the car and bring her home.
All right, guys. Well, Barb decided not to stay behind after all, and she wants to come with me um, at least a bit further. So we've now traveled back another three miles. Yes, indeed. And she's doing really good, I can tell you. It's getting hot, but it's still not too bad. Not like it will be in about a month when we will be extra miserable with cheese. But speaking of that glorious champion, here comes my beautiful wife, Barbara. <laughs> you made all the way up the hill. Yeah. Hell yeah, dude. Kill it. With the help of the You're saying, friends. saying, screw you, meniscus. So I'm bringing it into line. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Do it all the time. Yeah, yeah. yeah. We don't have a spoon. <laughs> you forgot your spoon? No problem. Ah, we have the, the spatula. spatula from TJ Maxx. So Barbie, did you Sexy. did you stop hiking halfway through like a damsel in distress and I come rescue you? No, I did the whole thing. Today. Did you do the whole thing? Yes, you did the whole thing. Yeah. Oh my God, guys! If anybody wants to know who my hero is, that's my wife. Yes, indeed, she did the whole thing. Stuff that like kids that are twenty can't do with a busted meniscus as well. So meniscus, you can kiss us. Yes, indeed. <laughs> Till next time. <laughs> <laughs> Have fun out there. <laughs>